going on you guys it is john here welcome back to another video so today we're back on clash of freaking clans we're back on clash of clans it's so exciting let's go uh we're back for the let's play on my tunnel late account we are almost done maxing out tunnel late but all that is left is as you can see from our little builder friend is obviously upgrading the town hall but also all of the dark elixir upgrades so we have some dark elixir upgrades here we have uh we have three to go in the laboratory and we have of course the barbarian king himself so you know what this calls for the next episode of the let's play series basically this one too but i'm gonna have a cool thumbnail and start a little mini series it's gonna be the dark elixir quest for town hall max town hall 8 um so that series is gonna be coming out next um uh, as a part of the let's play series because all we need is dark elixir so i was like we need to make a little mini series to get ourselves at dark elixir so today we're gonna be we're just gonna be on the grind for dark elixir i'm putting my dark elixir storage in the center of my base because when i do that not many people get it um i it's like you know i got 89 here 69 oops, 69 uh 44 71 these guys didn't even get any um so that's that's the goal i want to have that in the middle so i can save up as much dark elixir as i can the next the first actually you know what upgrade should we go for first i think we're gonna go for the king first because he's thirty thousand. um that's our goal let's jump into the raids let's get back one nation to the clash of clans let's play alrighty guys so I'm gonna pick this raid because it has uh, this base has I can't pronounce the name but this base has 700 dark elixir looks like it's in the center of the base but all the defenses are very low upgraded so I think we're gonna be able to make it in pretty easily oh my goodness it's so much fun playing this game again I love clash clans it's such a great game I haven't been playing a lot recently so it's really nice to get back to things and just you know feel the game the way it the way it is so we're gonna go ahead and get into this base I, I feel like it should be relatively easy to break through all of these walls get our king going in here we just killed his king uh, we got the we got the we got the base completely unlocked now and now I want my goblins to surgical goblins to go into the center and get that money let's go okay looks like he has some really good clan castle but luckily for us we've already taken out most of his base uh, I don't really mind if we lose uh, as all I care about is we get that that DE because we are on the quest for dark elixir right now um, we got 35 you know we have 35% might as well try to go for the W we might, we might as well you know guys we just might as well uh, we're gonna open this up here we're gonna get things going over here I'm just gonna drop the rest of my guys maybe we'll be able to get 50% maybe we won't you know that's okay either way it goes we've gotten that like about 600 dark elixir as long as I get about 600 500 dark elixir every every game I'm happy um, because that means we're moving up quickly uh, all right we got our 57 percent so it looks like we're actually gonna come out with the win as well I'm gonna go ahead and uh, end of the battle didn't even need to use the king uh, 546 dark elixir that's pretty good that's pretty good I, I I'll take that I'll take that any day um, looking solid okay if you also what the heck happened to my trophies like where did where did they go where are they why are they not here uh, these are all questions I have but we're gonna have to answer them with another raid let's go ahead and jump into it um let's see if we can get some more all right well when it's laid out literally for free i'm gonna have to go for it this is literally free dark elixir so you know what i've, I've got to just go for this base it's right here we're just we're gonna have to get that dark elixir we're just gonna have to this is one of the guys that does no walls no defense is pretty impressive uh i've never done it myself um i've only done clash without collectors but the, no, no defenses that's just got to be tricky and no walls that's just that's a hard life right there um, but we are gonna go ahead nonetheless try to just absolutely destroy this guy's base maybe get some more trophies back see we're answering that question I have no I mean like honestly I didn't think I was gonna drop trophies so quickly I think it's because I had my town hall on the outside that's definitely why but I dropped so many trophies I think I was at 1500 before I relogged on uh, just today so and that's uh, that was a few weeks so I mean in a few weeks I dropped like 600 trophies so that's I mean honestly that's an achievement in itself uh, in a bad way but it hopefully we'll be able to get those trophies back I'm gonna go ahead and just drop everything uh, we'll get everyone going here the wall breakers are going in let me see if ah, I wasn't even able to drop all of my troops before the end of the battle about 412 dark elixir actually not about it's exactly 412 dark elixir for this win 100% win 
21 trophies. Uh, we're over 9,000 Dark Elixir. Put it on the board. We're at 9,000 Dark Elixir. Over 9,000 Dark Elixir. That is where we're going to be wrapping up today's episode of the Let's Play series, Quest for Dark Elixir, um, for maxing out Tower Hall 8. Um, that is going to wrap up today's episode. Thank you guys so much for coming out. We'll be trying to get that Barb King in the next few episodes. Uh, if you guys did enjoy, be sure to smack the like button below. Comment what's up in the comment section below. I'll be replying to you guys. And I'll be seeing you guys next time. Hey.